why Daredevil from 2003's Jennifer Garner is the best part. Recently, it was announced that Jennifer Garner would be playing Electra Nachios in Deadpool 3 again, 20 years after she first played the character in 2003's Daredevil. The movie, which stars Ben Affleck as the title character, has received mixed reviews from reviewers and viewers and isn't well respected in the pantheon of comic book movies, but Jennifer Garner's portrayal of Elektra is worth your time and is, quite honestly, the finest thing the movie has going for it. Garner established her talent and physical prowess to take on action-packed parts before landing Daredevil the action thriller television series Alias, which aired from 2001 to 2006, brought the actress widespread notoriety for her portrayal of CIA agent Sidney Bristow. The show was well received by critics, and it gained a devoted following of viewers who admired Garner's portrayal of the complex spy who over the course of the series dealt with serious hardship while remaining both physically and emotionally strong. For her troubles, Garner received four Primetime Emmy Award nominations, a Golden Globe and SAG Award for her role on the series. The large studio film she arranged during her early run on Alias was ideally matched for what she was presenting TV viewers on the tiny screen, and she looked virtually destined to transform her television career into movie magic. Daredevil appeared to be an excellent bet. With 1998's Blade, Marvel started their major film run, and things only got better from then. Following X-Men in 2000, which enjoyed enormous success, Spider-Man changed the game in 2002 and paved the way for other comic book movie adaptations. In 2003, Daredevil would come next. And, to be honest, it seemed like the sensible thing to do given the success of those two movies. Although perhaps not a household name, the character is well known to comic book readers, and there was a chance to use the material to play things a little darker. In terms of tone, Daredevil might very well be Marvel's Batman.